D stands for Derby, D. Wayne Lucas, and Dublin. Trainer D. Wayne Lucas goes after his fifth Derby win with Dublin, the son of 2005 Preakness and Belmont winner a Fleet Alex. They are at the top of the stretch in the hopeful, and it is Dublin going head to head here with Westover Wildcat. Westover Wildcat, Dublin wandering to the outside, but Dublin's got a narrow lead now. Aspire comes on through in between horses as they come down to the finish, and it is Dublin who wins the hopeful by two lengths on the wire. Dublin made his presence felt with that victory in the 2009 Hopeful Stakes, a win that put him on the path to the Derby. He's been a consistent earner in his three-year-old campaign. Within the money finishes in the Southwest, Rebel, and Arkansas Derby. The question is, can Dwayne Lucas turn this contender into a winner when it counts most on the first Saturday in May? Opinions vary. He ran a stinker to my way of, uh, of looking at it in the Rebel, and he had no excuse in the Arkansas Derby. So I, he's, you know, he, maybe he'll clunk up for third or fourth in a trifecta, but I cannot see him winning this race. I don't even know if he wants to win. This horse has to be running uh, 13th or well, 14th in the Derby. That's the only way he has a shot to win because he doesn't have the turn of foot. He's a big, big horse, and he hits the ground very hard, and he's one pace. So what you want to do, the one thing he has that's going in his favor is that he has a very long, sustained run. He can start his run at the 5 8 pole and keep going and coming and coming and coming. We'll see who's right on May 1st at Churchill Downs. And that's another Kentucky Derby profile.